Hello, YouTube. Um, I'm just gonna show you some stuff that I use in sketching, drawing, you know, pens, pencils, sketch pads, what have you. Um, <clears throat> first off, I'm gonna go with this. Right. This is a journal. Apparently, she's using it to like write down ideas because um, it's made by it's come to in France. Now, these guys did make a sketchbook, and I really want one, but they're discontinued. The paper in it is awesome if you just take the line. Um, it has like a little bit of a tooth. It's very nice. I mean, I've had like ink spills on here, you know, and turn the page. You can't see any of that. It didn't even go through, and that's like, that was a pretty heavy ink spill. That's a cool little placeholder. I mean, you get a lot of bang for your buck. It's not that expensive at all. And, um, it's like silvery pages and stuff. I think the sketchbook had gold. At Secompta, you need to make your sketchbooks again. Done with that. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> I've used moleskin. Alright. I'm not going to show you a moleskin. I'm sure you guys know how they look. Maybe you don't. I use all different sizes. This is like the most common size. It's got a little band. That's how you know it's moleskin. It's just a moleskin. A moleskin. It's cool. You got a little pocket in the back. Keep your stuff in there. Um, really good thick paper. <clears throat> As the placeholder. The paper's sort of like a little yellowy color. It's not completely like bleach white or white. Um, I love using them too. I started using fountain pens. Recently got into that. I've been into it for about a month or two. And um, the ink like beads up on the paper. The paper's a little slick. Now pencil, beautiful. I don't work in pencil a lot. I use pencil just to like sketch my stuff out. I don't do any finals in pencil. But um. Yeah, the water just beads up on the, the, the ink, like beads on the page. It sucks. It's uh, it's not cool. I don't like it. So I sort of went to broaden my horizons a little bit, I guess. So now I'm using this. Um, I like plain looking things. I, I normally don't like these on sketchbooks. That's like a that's like a hell no. But, it's a pink pig. I know. A little weird. But it's an awesome sketchbook. I mean, great page. Pages, great paper. It's fairly, fairly thick paper. It has a nice light tooth to it. Totally bleach white. Um, and it can handle some ink. Like, this right here is all just straight ink on there. You can brush. And and like, you can barely even see that really. So it's a, it's a good sketchbook. I really like it. I mean, everything I've used on it, I've used micron pens, every kind of pen that I'm about to show you. And um, <clears throat> they all work great. Alright. Alright, put some tape over it. I don't want to grip. I sort of hold it. Let's put it back. Um, this is like a .25. So, uh, Noir, I'm going to say, these are good pens, really fine, used a lot back in the day for illustration. I have a lot of these pens, and this is the only one that works. I sort of don't recommend them, because they get clogged up, they're expensive as all get out, and they're not like an everyday use pen. I mean, if you want one, get one, fool around with it, they're fun. Um, they give a really nice line, but <clears throat> they mess up. I mean, I've tried every way, none of man to clean the ones that I got. I bought this little thing, and this is like a specialty cleaner, it has like a solution and everything. 
they don't get clean, man. They don't even work. I don't even know what's wrong with them. I wasted like probably like two, three hundred bucks. Right, just down the drain, just flush it down. Down. All right. This is what's awesome. Brush pins. These pintails. These are cool. These are awesome. They cover a really big area. They come in like a variety of colors. Good stuff. You can refill them too, which is awesome. Got some of these little calligraphy pens. Now these are felt tip. Normally I hate felt tip. Felt tip suck. I don't know. Feathering, stuff like that. That is why I hate microns. Whoever uses these, good for you. I don't care. I hate them. They're gross. They make me just want to go use the restroom. Anywho, these right here, Zig calligraphy pens. These were like four bucks. They're awesome. I mean, the big one, if you're just shading something in, coloring it in, you can cover a very large area. <clears throat> I like it. These are a couple of my favorite, my favorite pens, everyday use pens. These right here. Uniball, Vision, Micro, and Fine. Fine is 0.7. Micro is like 0.5. They're awesome. Um, yeah. Uh, another little pen school. I got like a white pink gel pin thing. I don't know. It's cool. It gives your stuff a lot of depth. Nice stuff. The Olympus Sharpie. Use that all the time. Coloring in stuff and whatnot. Now this is uh this is my favorite pen. I cannot find them anywhere anymore. I've had this for like years. It's not ran out. I've used the hell of it. I have no idea how it hasn't ran out. But it's awesome. It's Uniball Vision Exact Micro. If anyone knows where to get these besides eBay, because eBay, they're like ridiculously expensive. If anybody knows any stores that would carry these, or if you have some that you don't like or you don't use, and just want to be a good person, and just have, like, just good, I'll give you good luck. And just want to send me one, two, three of these, you know, I'll be your best friend. I'll cut off a piece of my beard hair and send it to you, and that's good luck. Anyway, it's awesome. Look at that. That's beautiful, mate. Hold on. That is beautiful. It has like the rubbery grip, jelly. I love it. I love it. It's like it's like a cheaper version of one of these. This. And this is better. I, I don't know. Love this pen. So I'm going to be buried with two of them. One just in case. <clears throat> yeah. Pencils that I use. These guys. These are awesome. They come in like a pack of three if you can find them. And they're awesome. 0 0.9, 0 0.7, 0 0.5. What more can you ask for? I like them. They're cool. Let's see. Also, <clears throat> I like using this thing, like lead holder. There's some lead in there. I mean, it's it's pretty nifty. You know, just for doing quick sketches. You can also control what you know lead weight you have in here, which is cool. And the the end little cap. There's no eraser, but it's a sharpener. If you want a little point, sharpen that up. Wonderful. Something else. Another cool pencil. Found this at like. Well, arts and craft store close to my house. You should be able to find them pretty easy. Um, some Milan red and blue little pencil. You know, if you're drawing something and you want to like photocopy it in or uh, scan it, whatever. You, know, you can sketch out in blue, do the black lines over it. Red, I think, shows up on the top here pretty positive. But um, yeah, even if you want to like a little variation, I don't know. I love that thing. It's a little multitasking. Before that. I use these little watercolor pencils by Five Big Castell. And they're cool. They're like triangle. Those are that's a triangle shape pen. I'll show you that triangle shape. Look at it. In awe. Erasers. I like kneaded erasers. Cool stuff. But I love fax erasers. Plain old fax erasers. Awesome. To paint, I use this. Yes, I paint with a box. No, it is watercolors. They're sort of expensive, like 20, 30 bucks, because you want these. It lasts a long time, though. 
Got a little mint some palette, some colors, come with a little paintbrush right in there. Ooh, I like it. <clears throat> what else do I use? These things are awesome. Water brushes. Doing watercolors or even ink washes. These are cool. These are like four, five, seven bucks. More, more. They come in different brush sizes and stuff too. I use <clears throat> nib pens. Sometimes I have more nibs. I haven't been through lately. These brushes. I like brushes. Brush, brush. You know, these are like, um, I don't really pay attention. This is a script brush, though. <clears throat> I don't really pay attention to brand names and stuff. I get it. I try it. Writes good. I use it. You know? Anything else? I don't know. Most of my stuff. I use, uh, I use Noodler's Ink. Noodler's Inks are awesome. The majority of the blacks are what's known as eternal. These are waterproof, bleach proof, sun proof. They're awesome for artists that like using ink and well that's me. I got have a I have a couple of different kinds. I've got someone older and I'll do a video on that too. Um, an un unboxing. I actually ordered a lot of stuff. Got a tax return. Um Yeah. I think that's all my stuff that I use. If you have any suggestions, you know, tell me what you guys use. Tell me what pins are awesome. I love using pins, you know. <clears throat> like, uh, I mean, I told you I got in the fountain pins, you know, I got these. got this uh, pen and ink sketch. It's pretty good. It actually did something weird. I had to, like, take it apart and, like, clean it and, like, work on the nib a little bit. I felt pretty B.A. when I fixed it. That was cool. <clears throat> got another creeper. Maybe my Conrad, which people give some flack because it's a dry pen. You know what? If it's dry and it gives you a frown, turn it upside down. The pen and the frown. Because once you do one or the other, you're happy. Because it makes it wetter when you draw. Lamy Safari. Good pen. It has like a cool little, I don't know if you can see that cool little, like a script section. And I got I don't know what just happened if you can hear me. Oh my gosh, my computer just totally cracked out. I don't even know what just happened to my computer. Like went to sleep, it's plugged up. I don't know what's happening. Anyway. Noodler Ahab. Got one of those too. All really good pins. And, uh, I don't know, I guess that's it, dude. I don't know. Yeah. I don't even know what to do. I keep freaking looking at the screen instead of the, like, camera. I mean, like, it's like, where should my eyes go? Do you, do you viewers really care? Let me know. Do you care that you can see the screen in my glasses? I'll take them off. No, I don't want to take my glasses off. Mm. I have to go to work here pretty soon. I'm a lazy bastard. I'm not a fan of working. Even though I work hard. Like there's better stuff I can do with my time, such as like cure world hunger or like live with like a I don't know some kind of like new combustion engine. Hmm. I think that's. <clears throat> yep, I'm done. I'm done. Got my clockwork orange poster. I want to see how, like, red I can get my face.
It didn't work as well. Pretty fucking bad. Whatever. Stop recording.